Welcome back my freaky friends. So today what we're gonna do, as you see this huge heavy mold in front of me, why it's on the ground, is because I'm too weak to pick a 300 pound mold up and put it on a table. Anyway, what we're doing is I put some uh, latex in there and we're gonna foam fill it, then we're gonna make some wrapped up dead bodies. So stay tuned, I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do that. So here's our body. What we're going to do now is we're going to start wrapping it with a uh, hemp rope. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use a little bit of hot melt glue just to kind of hold it together so it doesn't pull itself apart. So we want to kind of wrap it kind of tight if we can. We're just going to put a couple up here on his neck.
so this is a mixture of rit dye of black and brown to make it kind of crappy looking. And what I'm gonna do is where the rope is, is I want to highlight those just a little bit more than the rest of it. I want them just a little bit darker. Now guys, you can stop right there if you want to, but we're not. We're gonna add some blood to it now and see what we come up with. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this on these stumps and make them kind of darker than, because I want the, the blood to really be kind of darker down here on these stumps. They're all part of them anyway. Okay. Okay, and we'll do these other stops. Okay. So now we'll take our perma blood. Okay. And so I'll probably have to use this you know, a couple times, put it on, let it dry, then redo it again. What I'm gonna do is use a brush. All right. So we wanna put some on, on these stumps.
guys there's our half body we wrapped him up throwed some rope on him and painted him up throwed some perma blood on him yeah it looks okay we hope you enjoy the video uh sorry i didn't get very very much into detail i'm gonna make more then maybe i'll just throw some stuff up on facebook for you to kind of get into more detail of kind of what i did but uh what i did was spray some dark brown uh dye on the painter's claw and we took and uh put some black around the ropes a little bit then we kind of spread out our uh primer blood from that i don't think it turned out too bad yeah probably good for a hunt Anyway, guys, we hope you enjoy this little build, and uh, don't forget to go check out my trio brother. That's David the Weird Kid Show, Keith the Cobwebs and Candlesticks. Go show them some love and support, and uh, we hope to see uh, you make one of these one day or something of it. This is a little bit more in depth because I already made a mold a while back, and it is uh, this is versatile. It can be if you got if you get tired of the the body looking like this, you can take the painter's cloth off and paint your latex body and and make it something else if you want to but anyway i figure i'd make one of these maybe stick it in our hot maybe sell it i'm not sure what we're going to do but anyway we hope you enjoy don't forget to like share and subscribe and we'll see you on the next video thanks for watching keep it creepy